I'm Airman Hilton. I'm from Public Affairs. That's Airman Swift back there. He's filming me. Uh, before we get started, does anybody know what Public Affairs does? Dang. Um, basically, <clears throat> basically um, it's just the Air Force's uh, connection to the public, to the general public. Um, say someone is asked to do an interview for a local news station, the first place to go is Public Affairs to get clearance for that, tell you what you can talk about, what not to talk about. Okay, sweet. That's a really good answer. So like basic training, right? When they were going over, if you ever get stopped outside of the base and you get asked questions, always tell them. Refer them to public, refer them to public affairs. And that's us. And I didn't realize that when I was going through basic until I got here. But yep, that is us. Cool. Our mission as PA is to tell the Air Force story by pushing the commander's priorities. Enhance readiness, building leaders, taking care of airmen and families, and to develop trust among mission-focused airmen. To accomplish this mission, we post on multiple public-facing platforms as well as the local newspaper, The Mountain Home Patriot. Um, what was your name, Jones? As Jones uh, said a second ago, media asking you questions to help tell your story locally and Nationally, the 366 Fighter Wing Public Affairs Office will make sure that the media will ask the appropriate questions, will prepare you for any interview, and help facilitate any base or flight line photography for media affiliates. So basically, yeah, we will make sure that you sound good in front of the camera, tell you what to say, what not to say, and of course we're not going to leave you out there to dry, we're not going to prep you and then leave you with outside media by yourselves. We're going to stand by and make sure you say all the right things, and if things go south, we will give them a warning or pull you back if we feel the need to. So never be afraid of that. Uh, these are the platforms we are on. We are on Facebook. We are on Twitter. We are on Instagram. And our base website, mountainhome.af.mil, as well as the DOD imagery archive, dividshub.net. Is there anybody here that is following us on any of these platforms already? I know y'all just got here. Nobody? Okay, sweet. Well, follow us on any of these platforms because we post cool stuff. Studio photos. This is the other thing that a lot of people forget that we do. But if you're up for, you know, promotion or you're going on a PCS or a deployment or whatnot, uh, you need to get your official photos taken, uh, passports, ISO preps, stuff like that. You will come to us for that. And the way that you schedule that is you go online to the base website. And under contacts, it's the second tab from the bottom, is uh, schedule your official photos. And that's how you would do that. But don't worry, because you will forget. And call us. Just call us, and we'll walk you through it. It's really easy. Boom. Every airman has a story. This is my favorite part. So who does cool stuff outside of your regular job at the Air Force? This is the exact same answer I get every time I do an FTAC brief. This is like my fourth that I've done, and this is the answer that I always get. It's just complete silence. Who does cool stuff in the Air Force? What do you do? Sweet. That's cool. What do you do? I see you. What was it? Cyber transport. Cyber transport. That's dope. Anybody else? I want like at least one more really interesting job before I move on. Not, y uh, not you, though. I have to edit that out now. Thank you, Swift. Nobody? What do you do? Um, I'm air crew flight equipment. That's cool. Why would you not think that's cool? All right, so anyway, my point is every airman has a story like you guys do. And part of our job is telling other people that story to let people know outside or within the Air Force the, cool, the kind, of, kind of cool stuff that you guys are doing. Sorry, I'm very dehydrated. So if you guys ever think of anything cool that you're doing, like contact your leadership, tell them to contact us. We're always hungry for stories about cool airmen doing cool things. So just keep that in mind. And that is our, are we still briefing PA for a day or are we skipping that now? No? All right, cool. Well, yeah, okay, that makes sense. Weather? Email weather. What do we post them on now? 
because we don't have Gunfighter Snow anymore. Oh, yeah, check our Facebook for weather updates. I'm sorry. <laughs> there we go. I didn't know we replaced it with something. But, yeah, so uh, this next winter, I know we just passed when you got like a whole year to wait, but if you don't know anything about Idaho, the winters are pretty crazy here. So if you want updates, make sure you keep, like, who's from somewhere that it just doesn't snow? Anybody? Oh, my God. <laughs> Where are y'all from? Florida. Florida, okay. Dang. All right. So snow is a scary thing. If you've never like experienced it, never driven in it, you're going to want to know when it's going to snow, how bad it's going to be, how the roads are going to be, how much time extra you're going to need to warm up your car, clean your car off, drive at a reasonable speed so you don't hit any black ice or anything like that. So regularly check our Facebook because we'll post stuff like that. Um, does anybody, that's all I have for the slides. Does anybody?